Hey guys, what if you're and welcome back to NASCAR Elves Crew 1 for episode 60 is the first race in this playoff stuff. And it's time. We're back at Darlington. This track has cucked me way too many freaking times. I want to go into this and just win. Just so disgustingly well for all the hell it is given me. I I I shut the game off and then turned it back on, so it made me lose all of my stuff, so that's fun. I went through all the settings, you know, that looked at the tutorial stuff again for like the 40th time because this game is so broken that they patched it and forgot to, you know, get rid of that. So, yeah, what an absolute shame. So, uh, Speedway, uh, we'll just, yeah. So, going into Arlington, I think if anyone knows by now, uh, they know. Uh, this track has uh, cursed me for far too long, and uh, I've, I've quite had enough of it. So, I hope today we can just go into it and just utterly just destroy the field. So, that's my goal. So, yeah, there's really not a whole lot else to look at other than just, you know, jumping into it. So, we got momentum. We're going into it with the best stuff possible. So, that's always a plus. So, yeah, there we go. So, there we go. Also, oh, oops, settings. I forgot to show that because people are going to think I'm, like, cheating or something if I don't. Okay, so, legend, everything's in there. There we go. So, same stuff as always. Now, without further ado, let's jump into it. But, as always, a big shout out to my tier 2 Patreon people, as well as my YouTube members for supporting my channel. Again, I appreciate that. Every month does help me out a ton. You get perks like early access to the videos before they get released, as well as channel emotes and stuff on my live streams. So, those are the, the perks and all that good stuff. So, without further ado, let's continue this good stuff streak. I don't know. And uh, win at Darlington. Through three and four, this car was a monster in practice. About half a second quicker than the goal time. This one should be, we should destroy the goal time for this. We're going to start well in the top 10 for sure. And 29.9, and that's not, not bad. We're on the inside line. That's even better. I could have gotten maybe about 10th quicker, but again, this has been a, a rant forever where, of course, Ryan Blaine's up there. That, that's a rant that can go on forever too, but yeah, just if they gave us another lap, I could probably get like a 29.8. So, I mean, it probably would have only but gave me, like, another spot. But at least we're on the inside line, so that's good, unless someone gets sent. Yeah, okay. Yeah, thanks, game. Yep. Yep. That, that one extra spot could have been the difference between me being on the outside or inside, so that's wonderful. So, Austin Dillon's a snowflake. Uh, Kyle Larson went to the back. I don't know. I'm just tired of this game cucking me here. I'm just really, really fed up with it. And, of course, Ryan Blaine's right there in front of me. Just to, to make post-editor what if just Java more of a nightmare. But that was an absolute disgusting start of a biblical proportions. And we're just going to go for the lead right away. Fuck it. Three, go three wide. Or off the racing surface. <laughs> All right. I'll take it. Damn. All right. We, we did not get into play today. We're, we're gone. We're pitting this lap. We're going to be hitting zero probably going into turn three. But we'll be, we'll be fine. We pulled away to such a disgusting lead. Chase Elliott's pitting. Kurt is running 25th. And, and he's in the playoffs. That is... I mean, that... That kind of ruins my day a little bit. The game, for the game to cuck him that hard at a track like this, where he usually doesn't do that bad. So, Don't understand it. We're pitting this lap. We got a fast car. Like, it, I'm just... You just never know. I can't trust this game. Like at Daytona, where they gave me the random speeding penalty, and I was going like 53 miles an hour and a 55. Like, it, was that good enough? I, I don't know, but... Actually, actually, we're, <laughs> that works out really good, because then we can stay out, have the whole pit sequence, and still maintain the lead, and we are now... Weirdly enough, on our way to get, try to lap. Oh my god, try to lead every lap. I can't talk, I'm so mad. <laughs> okay, it kept us in the lead, so that's good. We know we got the amazing restart gear in it, as you saw from the beginning of the race. So it also changed my camera angle, so that's wonderful. No biggies, though. But yeah, we're just, I'm on a mission. I, I'm sorry if this is not like super, like, high octane entertainment, but I have to just, I, I can't. Well, then again, I never really just, like, try to put on a, like, I never, I never try to enter, like, like, intentionally run worse to be entered, to make the video entertaining. I just, I just, just I just run the track. And just, the, the greatness just kind of happens naturally. But yeah, um, we're doing fine. Should be a pretty easy stage one dub, so, uh, yeah, we're just, you know, gonna cruise. And we get the stage one dub. Did everything right, led literally every single lap, went from sixth to first. And score the victory in stage one. So, yeah, we did We did very good. And Gregson's 13th casually. And Kurt is running horribly, so that's just... Yeah. Yeah, thanks game for making Kurt just run... Yeah, oh, yeah, he's the, he's the last car in lead lap, I think. I'm not sure if he is or not. No, he's, he's beating Cody Ware. Holy shit. 
What an accomplishment game. Thank you. Thank you for doing that. After the pit stops, we're still first, so we're good. I got music on standby. I got Freebird, so like the beginning part can like reset me because I'm too keyed up now. And then as the second half goes on, it just like it gets me all tense again. So it's it's a good reset song for for my my anxiety because th we're doing good, but I don't trust myself or this game to throw something absolutely weird in my way. So yeah. Uh oh, now I, I touched I touched Hesemans. That's gonna make him a rival from that, even though I think I've raced him clean for literally like maybe over a season now. But no, I'm sure that'll probably piss him off. So. Yeah, th thanks game for having the rival system about the worst it's ever been with just how it degrades and how it just like almost never does so I don't know that's that was significant damage I actually got like nose damage from that so yeah that that's seven uh I might have just add another rival to my my list today well my no, Bubba doesn't really count because I, I don't think it's really close to being rival so that's not really anything to worry about how do you code the Kurtz AI to be so bad here 27th that's just, that's just wrong. There's just another word to describe it. That's just absolutely wrong. There's like stage one. We're going to be pinning this lap and everything. It just hit zero. So, yeah, I mean, it's just same as the first race. Or same as the first stage. 45, perfect. Stand forward, tire stop, and out of the way. Repair the damage, and I think we'll still cycle out first because we had a pretty big lead beforehand. 18.2 second stop with obviously the two second repair time damage. We should cycle, uh, not only cycle out first, but I think we're still leading. Yes, we are. All right, well, that's good. That answers my question. So, yeah, it's just, it's promising. I've said this, like, 12 t different times, but we have to win this. Like, it's just, I'm, I'm tired of getting screwed here. White flag for stage number two. We just put Logano lap down, which is nice. I would like to maybe lap one more person. Okay, Bill's not really for position, so Logano's going to get the pre-pass, which is unfortunate. But at least I lapped it for my own self self-satisfaction. And we'll probably win this stage very effortlessly, so yeah, it's, it's good. Good. We got we got the dub. But how, how else is this game going to find a way to screw me? It's just... I don't know. We've been here before. Greg's, yeah, because Gregson's just casually 10th in a, in a beard oil car. Yeah, Kurt's running like 25th, getting outrun by freaking Ty Dillon. Yeah, thanks game for making that, that... Ooh! Ooh, that bugs me. It's just a simple file code that you change to, like, you know, uh, speedway performance and shit. Like, it's not complicated rocket science for that to be done. I've seen the game's code firsthand, well, P5, but, like, this and Heat 5 are very similar, so... I don't know, whatever, I'm done. So, four tires and fuel out in the way. Still first, so our quest to lead literally every lap is gonna continue. Kyle Busch is fast, though, he actually... I don't know where he was running before, but he was... He was nowhere in the top five, and then worked his way up to second, so clearly he is a fast boy, but... That start is not a fast boy thing, so, uh, yeah, we're good. Alright, bye, field. So, something I was thinking about, if this goes green, which... I almost scoff at the idea the game will actually, you know, have a, you know, a final stage go green the whole way, but we restart with about 33 to go. We can only make it about 16 on field, so we're going to be pitting with, like, two to go. So we'll have to pit twice, so that's interesting. So, yeah, we'll see how that develops, but, yeah, we'll just have to kind of wait and see how that kind of plays out, but kind of like what we did in stage one and two, we'll just stay out as long as we can and then pit. That's really our plan. We're pitting this lap. So, something to note is we hit one on fuel the previous lap off of turn two, and usually happens on the back straightaway, so we're burning more fuel this run than before, so... Yeah, and it actually went uh, way early, even earlier than that, so... It's interesting, but the rest of the field should pit, uh, pit twice here, and now we're sputtering, so... Yeah, just... I'm just staying out as long as I can just to be careful, because I, I don't trust this game. Don't! Okay, I was... Oh, that's gonna... Damn it, man! We're so close to pitting there! Now we're gonna, this fucking game, I tell you, it's try, it's gonna try everything it can to make sure I don't win this goddamn race. I, I know, I knew it. So yeah, we're pitting. Okay, restarted fifth. So we've gotten to sixth the first before. I think we could do it again. We we're so close to getting down here for that to count, and my disc space is freaking the fuck out. So I don't even know if it's gonna be picking up. Why is it just the universe itself just refuses to let this race be captured properly? Also, that was an amazing start like usual, so... Yeah, nothing changed there, but... Alright. God, just... <laughs> it's just amazing. It's just amazing what, what things could go wrong on and off the camera view. 
I guess we'll just have to babysit this fucking disk space to- Oh, now it calmed down. Yep, as soon as I look- Oh, it goes from 0 to 63 to 90%. What is fucking tri- Oh, is it- is the music? I'm so sorry. I'm trying to, like, entertain myself while I'm leading by, like, 8 seconds. I know the fucking tragedy of- of the whole circumstance there. I know I'm just doing something so- just- WILD! Because apparently Opera GX, which is built to be, like, a Chrome subsidiary, apparently just can't handle that. I don't know. So, game capture, and I don't know. Yep, it's just gonna freak out. Alright, so, th thanks, thanks computer for fucking up. I don't even know if it's capturing it properly. It, what else could I possibly do? To, even when I win this game, there's just some outside, like, force just making this a fucking shit show. I don't know what, like, what else to fucking do. I guess we'll get rid of fucking opera. I don't know. I guess that's just... If there's no... What else is could there be possibly open that makes this freak the fuck out like this? It's, it's actually amazing that it just... Like, what what else is making this go fucking bananas? Obviously, the only main thing that are, that are running that I know is taking up space is my game capture and OBS. That's it. There's nothing else here that should make it freak the fuck out. It was fine for, like, 40 minutes. And then all of a sudden, oh, minute 41, boom, just cr break everything. What an absolute fucking joke. Yeah, this space is still freaking out. There's just no... Ex oh, it's a fuck. It might be PCSX2. It might be because that's open. Maybe that that's the big culprit. I don't know. Sp How come I've had that open before? Like, all, so many other instances, and it's just fine. Now, apparently, maybe tonight that's just breaking it. I don't know. Oh, my God. Yep, still freaking out. So, I don't know. It's just a mystery. Unsolved mysteries or American horror stories. I don't know. Oh, oh, it went down to 70%. Oh, it went back up to 90, 98. Okay, never mind. So, that, why? Why? Why can't this just be a simple, I just absolutely fucking eviscerate the field, and then that's it. Nope, it just has to be like, oh, we gotta throw something else in because nothing else has happened. Jesus Christ himself is literally just making this race. He's doing everything he possibly can to make this entertaining. How does it go from 5% and then it goes back up to 80? Like, what What? What changed? Fuck it, I'm just gonna keep racing because I don't know if you'll be able to see it. I have no idea. But this, the God himself is not gonna let me fucking, I, no. I'm <laughs> I'm gonna keep fucking racing. And I'm not gonna let that, that bullshit ruin this race. So this might be like a big old fucking pixel. I don't know. But I'm just gonna keep racing because I'm, I'm just, I've had it. This track, I don't know, this track is fucking cursed. I hope I win this championship so I never fucking play this game again. I don't have to race this track again because apparently it is just haunted. Okay, things calmed down on my PC side of things. What what changed in between it? Absolutely nothing. But it it just it tried everything it possibly could to throw me off balance. Just like World of Outlaws, where like the, the random PC thing came up where it's like, oh your your Windows is gonna expire. It's just it's amazing. Just the amazing the just the the things that get thrown at me to distract me. Is, 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 there, there is a God. I, I, you know, there might be some speculation out there in the world, but with the things that happen when I play games, I believe it. I believe there is some kind of force out there. God or flying spaghetti monster himself is doing something. There, there is some other life form outside of Earth. Two laps to go. I don't know. Just, we've been in this spot before. Just the, the amount of bad luck things that happen. At this track, like this, this is gonna feel more, more like this is gonna feel like a Daytona 500 victory for me. Uh, a crown jewel event. We may not have won the the 400 mile version of this earlier in the year, but at least we're gonna put ourselves in position for the you know the 500 mile one. So I don't know. But either way, it's gonna be official. First and foremost, when we actually get in the turn one, don't hit the ta or don't hit or tap the wall. Also, we're very low on fuels. So that's a little concerning, but it don't matter. We're gonna be good enough to make it to the end. Just get through turn one. Don't tap the wall, and we're good. All right, that's that's one massive hurdle that was over 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 accomplished. I don't know what that means, but whatever. I'm, my brain can't comprehend things right now. It's just words are hard, and I'm I might be a little hard just just being in this position now leading, but we're gonna go through three and four, and we're gonna do it. Years, plural years of of problems with this track. We finally fucking done it. Eat that game, man. From the, from, not the game, but the frickin' 
a PC trying to have issues. I just kicked my freaking headset because I was trying to adjust my leg because my feet are falling asleep because all my body heat and all my, my my blood was going to my hands and it just like all all functions in my or in my 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 body was falling apart. Also, I can't just go around the track normal. I'm hitting reverse like 80 times and it won't pick it up because the game is broken. And I can't even just be slightly on the throttle because it does that because this fucking e this game it doesn't even deserve a fucking burnout. I tried. It just it's just ass. Finishing results for the first race of the round of 16. We win. We, we you know, lock ourselves into the next round. Ryan Blaney never had a chance to hit me. And he finished 8th. That was good. Gregson got 10th. That's bullshit. Um, a lot of people lapped down. That's Some of that was me. Some of that was because of um, that the, the, uh, yellow. That kind of messed things up at the end of the race. But Kurt got 26. That is absolutely disgusting. And Ty Dillon outran him, which is even more despicable. Same with Cole Custer. I don't, I don't know. Ooh. So people, two people DNF. That was BJ McLeod and Chase Briscoe. Dylan rain terribly. So I don't know. We'll take, our earnings are gonna be very good. 336 for merch, and that's very good. And we're gonna get that 700 something plus thousand because we got all the top 10 incentives. So that's gonna be even even higher amount compared to what we got with 700 thousand. That's pretty damn good. And that's our um, top 16. Oh look at that! They fixed it. It was it was like sliding before, and now it's like that actually looks kind of quasi normal. All right, well, that's good. Kurt is out by 11 points. So that's kind of infuriating, so, yeah. So, that's, I don't, I don't know what to say other than that we, we advanced. We did what we needed to. We led damn near every single lap except for maybe two or three during that last yellow. So, I mean, we, we got pretty damn close to it. So, we surpassed Ernie Irvin in wins, and I think we might have moved up in the lap led leaderboard thing. So, that's a plus, I think. So that was our fast laps of 29th, 6th. Good lord. And we led 91 of the... We only... We led every lap but one, apparently. <laughs> oh my god. Kyle Larson on the move from 39th to 3rd. At a track like that, that is pretty insane. And Bubba. <laughs> That's kind of funny. So monumental earnings. Th over 3 million with that. And then we'll get an extra 700 something bonus. I think we'll get modern driving for this. Because we did get damage from Hesman's. Because we tapped him because he was so slow. I think I lapped him like four different times. So hopefully he's not a rival after that. We'll have to wait and see. But next race is Kansas, which I don't really... I mean, last season we kind of got lucky with a good finish there, so I'm not really sure how that's going to go. Oh, okay, we still... He's upset. I don't know if that changed. I don't really know, but... Yeah, he's... Uh, he's Or he's angry, so yeah, he's... One... I don't know if that changed. I don't know. But I know what will never change is J.G. Ailey being my ultimate best friend, so that's adorable. So we'll get a work plan situated and then uh, look at everything else. Got the work plan situated also in this um, menu here. We got 3.7, so it does, yeah. So one, no matter where we finish at Kansas, we should have enough to uh, upgrade the suspension, so that'll be a 95. Obviously, I'd like to get a top 10, so we get that extra 700,000 bonus again. So that would be nice, but you never know. I mean, we'll see. So stat time, let's update that because boy howdy, we did we, we led a lot of laps today. So with our 16th win, that puts us in a column all by ourselves. So we are ahead of Ernie Urban, but below Curtis Turner. So we, yeah, it's progress. We surpassed someone, so that's always a big plus. Now laps led, we got 665 times that by four, that is 2660. <laughs> a lot of laps led in that race, good lord. Uh, so yeah, 2660. And that bumps us up all the way to, oh my, like, damn, we, wow, no, no, wait, hold on. Uh, we are ahead of Tim Richmond, but under Alan Quickie, so. Huh, I never really noticed that Quickie and Richmond, two drivers I really like a lot, are pretty similar in laps lead totals. That's interesting, so. Yeah, uh, major progress was gained on that. We were somewhere around 70th or something, we jumped up to like 66, so yeah, that was... <laughs> was really good so yeah if that was real life terms i think we would have led like every lap but four or something so yeah that was that was disgusting so yeah great progress all around and with that we'll wrap up today's episode a big shout out to my three patreon supporters of down Reynolds, kamikaze games dave for champ 15 bailey kira golf kill 100 mexican league 1986 mark Harmon, akbar fan 5556 and jason helmer for support again i appreciate you guys do for my channel every single month and all that it just does me a lot truly goes a long way so just thank you a ton and just thanks because this, that's, uh, it's very nice and very thoughtful you guys do that every month. 
I'll see you all next episode of Kansas, which I have no idea if we can get a top 10 there. So it's, it's up in the air. Bristol, even that, I don't really know. But it doesn't really matter because we advance to the next round. So I do know at a certain point, like I think Talladega, we could probably win. Roval, easily a win. Vegas, probably. I mean, there's going to be definitely a couple of races where we're just going to have just amazing runs. In Homestead, we were pretty close to winning last season with, with uh, 90 engines. So that should be an easy win there. It's just, it's just Martinsville. It, fuck, it's not Martinsville. It's just Phoenix. That's my biggest problem. I don't know. Like, I don't think we can get to the end of the season with 95 everything. We're going to be pretty damn close to it, I think. But I, even then, I don't know if that's enough. And if it's not, then we're going to have to do another season of this. And I don't know how I'm going to structure that. <laughs> if we're just going to just dominate races week in and week out, I might just start having to put like two episodes in, or like two races in the one video and just have them come out, come out like like every three days or something so I can because it takes a lot of time just to edit these and trim them down from the original like race footage and it's just it's definitely a, a pain in the ass but it's I guess it's not a pain in the ass but like it's doubly a pain when I have to do like bonus race time so I don't know I have to wait and see about it. so I'm hoping we can just win the championship and just kind of move on but you never know so that'll be interesting to see but yeah that'll do it for me I'll see you all next episode see you all later and as always have a good day, everyone.